Okay, basically this is going to show boot time and we're going to listen to it after uh, it starts running and we're going to see how quiet it is. I got the two screens. Sure, it'd probably run a little faster if I took out the other monitor, then boot through that one first. All right, Magic Jack is a good program if you have a decent computer. Um, it's actually pretty good. It's thirty dollars a year plus whatever startup fee it is. Uh, if you have a crappy laptop or a crappy computer, it'll probably be a little laggy. But I do recommend it if you have a good computer. Um, or a good laptop it is a good program and it does run good and without hardly any interruptions um, there was a flip down right here where uh, I put my mouse and whatever but I'm gonna undo my keyboard so you can see this will flip it shows the temperature of the I'm guessing of the motherboard plus uh, the fan control speed which you can control here as you can see it moving there uh, the hard drive and basically a timer and I can set it up for clock and what else what not we'll plug this back in I'm gonna take take this apart and where you can see inside so basically this is the inside I'm gonna put it right inside the camera right inside so you can hear the quiet it is really quiet the only thing that is loud is the optical drive that I put in and because it is shitty so uh, whatever I like to give support to Porta cable I have all their stuff and it's they've never break broken down on me uh, but other than that that is my review for Magic Micro. I believe it is a good build. The customer service is really good. Uh, they're definitely willing to work with you and help you get your computer running. I did have an issue once I in installed the video card. For some reason, the catalyst, one of the catalyst drivers, slowed down my. Um, it actually slowed down my internet speed. I don't know why, but as soon as I un installed it. Uh, we're only getting 10 megs out here, but I was getting 10 and a half once I installed it, but, or once I uninstalled it. When I installed it, I dropped down to 3 and 4 megs. So, if you're having internet issues from that, then you might want to look at that, uninstall that from your uninstall programs, and run another speed. I use Ookla, which is a really good test. Alright, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hopefully, it was helpful for you to make your decision. Y'all have a great day, and enjoy.